is taking strides towards making the town more bike and pedestrian friendly. It's all part of a plan drafted by the Bicycle and Pedestrian Path Committee. The plan links neighborhoods, shops and schools by interconnected sidewalks, trails, paths and lanes. At the moment, there are existing shared use paths in areas like Shelburne Bay Park and Webster Road and several bike lanes and shoulders throughout the town. But the town is looking to connect all those systems to make the space easier and more enjoyable to get around. It's bigger than just bike and paths in the sense that it addresses multiple aspects of how do you build a infrastructure that supports micromobility but also um, supports the economic development, the health, uh, climate change, all those things is kind of bundled together. It's not just a trail in the woods. The next steps towards making this plan a reality are finding funding from the town, the federal government, and from grants. Jones says the town wants to take steps towards building a pedestrian path over the La Plot River and adding more bike lanes. A new fund to ease the burden on taxpayers rebuilding from this summer's floods. The floods did a number on local infrastructure, wastewater plants, roads, and